I'm the Commonwealth and British uh, record holder for the 50 metre breaststroke, silver medalist at the European Champs, competed in three uh, international swimming league competitions. This is my first time experiencing a swim spa, I've never had the chance to be in one, uh, not really sure what to expect, so I'm quite excited. Um, I imagine it to be like swimming still in a, in a swimming pool on the bungee or something, but I'm not sure, so I'm looking forward to try it out. The first time I really enjoyed it actually, it was so much better than I was expecting. Um, you know, being a breaststroker, your arms are going wide, your legs are going wide. Didn't know, wasn't like sure how that would go, but didn't, had no clue that I was in, you know, something so small. I could have been in a big pool to be honest. I could put like full power through. Um, the current must have been really strong uh, with the bungee as well. So I could go pretty much max, max effort on the breaststroke. Um, so that's cool being a sprinter, you know, I'm either going nice and steady and um, doing all the like technical aspects which is perfect for a, in a swim spa but also I could get some of those max effort bursts going as well. Being able to put the jets lower it just made it feel more like natural swimming like you was actually moving and the waves were coming underneath you rather than almost just skimming on top. I mean within my week I have obviously every session has a different aspect I think for your recovery sessions after you've just done a really hard one the morning before or whatever, it's brilliant just to get in and do your recovery sessions, you know. I have to drive a 40 mile round trip to get to where I train. Um, sometimes I can only be in the pool for half an hour just doing pure technical focus on skills. And I think if you were to have this, it'd save you A, your trip, but you could also get some really technical timing without having to leave your house. I think it'd be perfect for a session like that.